Hey everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to be talking about how Dubai builds its man-made islands, specifically focusing on the Palm Islands. Dubai is a city known for its opulence, innovation, and grandiose projects. One of the most impressive feats of engineering in Dubai are the Palm Islands, a group of man-made islands in the shape of palm trees. These islands are not only a popular tourist destination, but they also serve as a symbol of Dubai's ambition and wealth. But how exactly were these islands built? It all started in the early 2000s when the government of Dubai commissioned a project to create three artificial islands off the coast of the city. The idea was to add more land to Dubai and create new real estate opportunities. The first island, Palm Jumeirah, was the smallest and most basic of the three. It was created using a technique called land reclamation, in which sand and soil are dredged from the bottom of the sea and used to build up the land mass. This process was carried out using giant dredgers, which pumped sand and soil through pipes and onto the site of the island. As the material was deposited, it was compacted and shaped into the desired shape of the island. The next island, Palm Jebel Ali, was much larger and more ambitious. It was designed to be a self-sustaining city with its own power and water supply. To create this island, a series of breakwaters were built around the site to create a sheltered lagoon. The lagoon was then filled with sand, which was compacted and shaped into the desired shape of the island. The final island, Palm Diera, was the largest and most complex of the three. It was designed to be a hub for business and commerce with a mix of residential, commercial, and recreational areas. To build this island, a series of channels and canals were dug around the site to create a series of islands. The islands were then connected by bridges and filled with sand, which was compacted and shaped into the desired shape of the island. All in all, the Palm Islands project required over a billion cubic meters of sand and over a million tons of rock. It was a massive undertaking that required the coordination of thousands of workers and hundreds of engineers. The project was not without its challenges, including environmental concerns and delays due to the financial crisis of 2007 and 2008. But in the end, the Palm Islands were completed and have become an iconic symbol of Dubai's ambition and prosperity. Thanks for watching everyone. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe to our channel. We'll see you in the next one.